Hello, hello to all our wonderful viewers and to all our wonderful followers. To all the people that have been following this YouTube channel, I want to say a big thanks to you. It's been a while I haven't come here to upload a video on, on tutorials, uh, tips and tools on YouTube, tips and tools. Uh, I'm coming back, you know, I've been, I've been a little bit hiding. But if you are just coming inside this channel, this channel is all about uh, helping you build your YouTube channel, uh, grow your YouTube channel. We are going to show you tips and tools on how to grow your YouTube channel. Uh, the YouTube algorithm monetization. We are going to teach you on how to, to, to optimize your videos, to get more views. And also on this channel, we used to show you on the behind the scenes on how we used to work uh, with our actors and actresses on how we build our movies. So on today's video, I'm introducing a new, 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 new course. The course is going to be on Adobe Premiere. All the people that have been seeing our videos, our videos have been edited on the Adobe Premiere uh, software. And that is the Photoshop, the Adobe, the Adobe company. A big shout out to the Adobe company. So on the Adobe Premiere, uh, I'm going to show you on, on the beginner's guide on how to open a project. Uh, we are going to guide you on step by step on how to open a project, how to cut video, on how to sync your sound, on how to edit your sound, on how to synchronize videos, on how to color collect, color collect your videos. So on this channel, we are going to show you a lot of things that we have been working on, on here with us. We are, we are going to show you. So if you are interested in learning on how to, 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 to use the Adobe Premiere for editing your videos, uh, this video is the right uh, 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 video for you and, and, and the right start for you. As we all know, this this channel is all about that so you can subscribe and 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 and, and let's go to the computer and let me show you on how to open a project with the adobe premiere we are going to use the obs to, to record this video we are using the obs to record this video right now i'm going to show you the adobe premiere first of all before we go further i'm going to show you my the, uh, the requirements that you need uh, on your pc to run uh, adobe premiere on your on your pc so that it can be comfortable you won't be uh, having problems on rendering and stuff. If you are first of all, uh, first of all, before you install Adobe Premiere on your computer, at least you have to have an uh, i5 computer, uh, i5, that is any i5, that is Intel i5, dual core, a processor of 2.5, at least gigs, 8 gig RAM, at least on your PC. Sometimes you can have uh, a 4 gig on your PC, it can run the Adobe. But a rendering a longer longer product than pro, project than uh, one hour is gonna is gonna take a longer time. But at least you have to have this this requirements on your PC as you can see here. It's an Intel i5 um, dual core. So you can see the requirements from there. You can install the Adobe Premiere when you go online. You can check on how to download free Adobe Premiere and download it on the torrent. If you don't buy it, you can download it. I'm gonna show you another other video on how to run the Adobe Premiere, download and run it. So right now, uh, I'm gonna open the Adobe Premiere. As you can see, I just click on it, hit here. It's on the tax bar here, you know. So I'm gonna click on that and wait for it. So while I'm opening, opening this uh, Adobe Premiere, I'm gonna come here on my desktop and, and, and click a folder. Uh, open a folder, that is a new folder. I rename this, testing testing project sorry as you can see testing project now uh, when I when I write testing project on here so uh, if I uh, if I went for a shooting that is a video shooting or anything that I've shot outside uh, uh, on a memory card when I come back I can still come back and, and go back to the memory card for example here the memory card here and, and, and for example this is the memory card uh, let me check sam that is cam1 as you can see i used to rename all my files when i come back i used to have this uh, project here sam cam1 cam2 rename all the project that is cam1 cam2 so all the footage is from cam1 that i film uh, i will put them here all the footage is from cam for cam2 i will uh, put them here so to, 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 to recognize but all these projects I'm gonna save it in one folder that is here you are gonna bring cam1 and cam2 all the the footages from cam1 are gonna come on cam1 for example new folder again cam1 then i will go and copy and paste that and put them there cam2 i will go copy from the the, the the memory card and put it here the other camera so that is how you create your folder first that is texting project then from there Let's go to the Adobe Premiere. There are a few things that I want to explain to you. 
here on the Adobe Premiere. As you can see, this is a recent, recent. We are seeing recent here. That is all the projects that I've been working on in the in the in the recent weeks. It is gonna show you. Uh, since when I've, I've opened this project, it was six hours ago. Hotels. It is a day ago. Do enemy friend. That was September eight. Sees. Uh, September 8 comments review that was September 6 so here the recent file is gonna show you all the the, the, the the recent projects so any of these projects that you want to click and work on it you can just click on here and just work on it but the next step is you are gonna see synchronized settings so for these settings you don't need to to, 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 to work on this one here for the big beginners guide you just need to understand this recent and the next step I'm gonna open here is that uh, so you is the talk about is the the, the, the new project this new project here you see is very important we are gonna concentrate on here this new project forget about open open project forget about new template forget about new team player we are gonna concentrate on this one as a beginner as a beginner you are just gonna come and click on this new project on the software so on the first thing we are gonna see is name so the name of the project we are gonna say testing testing then location we are gonna go to the desktop we are gonna click on desktop this is on the d drive desktop and check on testing don't forget about this it's very important you see testing i click on that it is here i click select folder as you can see it is on the location c user ultimate empire desktop testing project so anytime that you wanna uh, 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 see all the project files of this this project testing is gonna come here so what you are is what you are doing right now you are trying to save all the projects all the files all the 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 Adobe, you know, files that are gonna encode and everything, they are all gonna save in this project. So it's what we are doing right now. So forget about all this here. Don't never touch, don't touch anything as a beginner. Don't touch here. So we can just come and change. Uh, click on OK. If you click on OK, we are gonna have a project opened. So wait for it. Wait for it. Don't rush. Uh, don't rush. Uh, the computer is loading. It's loading because I'm using the, 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 the OBS to record this. That's why it is loading. Then from there, when you open this, you can click on here, new sequence. So for you to open a, a project and work with a project, you first have to uh, open uh, open and, and save the location and the name of the project. Then from there, you come here, new, and open a sequence that way, the, the sequence timeline, uh, on the sequence timeline that you are gonna work on. So here, I'm gonna, uh, talk about the settings here don't don't mind these tracks don't mind the sequence presets and everything here you are seeing <coughs> we're just gonna talk about the settings here we go straight to settings when we go to settings here we are <coughs> we are recording this video on we recorded this video on hd 10 atp is gonna remain like as it is then here we can reduce the, the frame frame rate per second we also used to record with 24 frames per second which is very close to 25 frame per second you have to change this to 25 or if if 24 frame per second was here you use that but 29 is too heavy when you uh, record on the camera with 24 frame per second you want to edit it with, with 29 frame per second it's gonna it's gonna slow when it is rendering and the footage are gonna break sometimes so you just have to maintain that here then forget about all this here don't touch the all everything here you don't have to touch nothing here don't touch nothing then you come here when you come here this sequence is gonna change again to testing you see then you click this when you click this you wait you are gonna see your timeline as you can see there is the timeline here there is the monitor uh, monitor here you have your your program the projects here the effects library testing so on the next uh, step of this video I'm gonna show you on how to use all these tools here tools there are so many tools that we, we will be using to edit with these are a few tools here you are gonna use but for today we are gonna stop here this is a simple way on how to to, to open a new project with the adobe premium to all the people that have been following me uh, this was a very simple tutorial on how to open a new project as a beginner with the adobe premium so i can close this when i close this project and go back to the folder we are gonna see what we did on, on, on opening this project thank you let me close this and come back here if you come here you can see the project cam1 cam2 the footage is here yeah. so you can see here that the project is already here when i click on this it's gonna take us back to what we've done and that is the timeline and everything is gonna be there so let me just open it again you see that was a successful 
uh, project that we opened and titled it and, 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 and filed it on a, on a folder, rename the folder name, don't forget about that, rename the folder, save everything on the location, browse to the location that is on the desktop, don't forget about that, uh, the settings are uh, 25 frames per second, you change that, if you are recording with 24 frames per second, you can change that 29 to 25, as you can see, this is a, it's a, it's a, uh, it's a project here for you, about to start to edit all you need to do is to come and import import projects you know and stuff import projects and come the projects will be there here and then you just come and drag it here on the timeline then you start editing your project but for today we are gonna stop here and until next time if you like this video and, and seeing it interesting you can still click on the, the 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 subscribe button and wait for more videos on adobe premiere thank you so uh, to all the wonderful viewers, if you really like that video, you uh, like the way we did the video and everything, you can just click on the like button and don't forget to, to subscribe and hit the notification. We are going to bring you more videos on Adobe Premiere. So this is just the starting. This is the first video on Adobe Premiere. Uh, so just stay on tune. I'm going to bring you more videos on how to color grade, on how to cut, on how to edit video clips. You know, you know, just name it. You, on how to synchronize your, your two, three scenes on when editing a movie clip. So you just stay on tune. This is ultimate tips for YouTubers. We are here to stay.